that the new Prime Minister continues to bet on technology to get his message across. Now, one key example has been uh, the PM India website that has been revamped even as Modi took over on Monday. Priya, in fact, spoke to her sources at the National Informatics Centre that hosts that website and gets us details of what changes have been made, Priya. Well, a tech-savvy Prime Minister Narendra Modi had it all in place and minutes after he was sworn in as the Prime Minister of India, uh, his website PM India went live uh, as far as the internet goes. But remember that uh, this has been a core team of five members that have been associated in the developing and production of the website. In fact, Bloomberg TV India exclusively spoke to National Informatics Centre, which has a team working 24-7 updating and formatting the website. But also they have another team which consists of data center team which manages the entire uploading and the server hosting as far as this website goes. In fact, they've been processing and creating graphics for this website as well. Con content, remember, has been provided by the PMO's office. Now, in fact, this website is very different uh, from the earlier website. It has several interactive features. It has uh, Twitter, it has Facebook, it has links where fans can like uh, the Narendra Modi page. In fact, also as far as the protection is concerned, they have a firewall application that protects the website from uh, outside threats. That's an additional layer of security uh, that they have uh, mentioned uh, as far as this website goes. But as far as the finances goes, the financial provision has been made uh, in the budget. So the NIC team has been closely working on this website for over a week. But remember, we also spoke to uh, the team with regards to what the future plan is as far as the website goes. In fact, this is another interesting feature. Interact with the Honorable Prime Minister has been a feature that where uh, people can send out messages directly to the Prime Minister. But going forward, they really plan to give the control of instant updates to the PMO's office where they will directly be able to update and upload uh, information on a daily basis. Also, they're boosting up the infrastructure because of the immense number of hits that the website has been seeing. So clearly, an interesting, interesting take as far as the website goes.